Many businesses are taking advantage of new rules, allowing them to operate outdoors. But some businesses, as Dave Valley reports, aren't quite as fortunate. Pismo Bowl sits empty, quiet since closing its lanes last week. It's everything to the business. Uh, you know, we're a bowling alley first and foremost. Making it impossible to modify operations like many other businesses. No, it's kind of hard to move this stuff. It's not going to go anywhere. I haven't gotten to the point where I'm willing to try it yet <laughs> anyway. Creating big challenges for the family center that's been around for more than 80 years. I can't be proactive. I can't problem solve my way out of this one. I just have to kind of sit on my hands and wait for the okay to turn it back on. I'm kind of, you know, there's really nothing else I can do. For the time being, it's relying on takeout food orders. The restaurant's been great. We're just thankful for the community support to get us to where we're at right now. Here at the Locked Inn in Grover Beach, there's no escaping the fact that what happens in the inside can't simply be brought out here to the outside. The experience itself is the rooms and being able to escape them and, um, you know, interacting with other people and large groups. So it's it, essentially what we're supposed to avoid right now. So there's um, nothing I can really do to be able to modify my business right now. So fingers are crossed. Health conditions improve soon. It's definitely terrifying. Um, just hoping that we can all kind of get through this and, and keep the doors open. With so many needing to have some fun again in the future. In Pismo Beach, I'm News Channel reporter Dave Alley.